It's a question we've asked for weeks. What would happen if and when an athlete tested positive for COVID-19 during the season or even during summer workouts? Well, now we have an answer. Friday night, Cathedral High School suspended all athletic activities until further notice after a fighting Irish football player that had been participating in the school's off-season workouts tested positive for the coronavirus. Cathedral opened up for workouts on Monday. The players participated in workouts through Wednesday and he exhibited symptoms on Thursday. He was then tested. The results came back positive earlier today. All student athletes and staff that had worked out at the school on the same days have been notified and strongly encouraged to get tested themselves and also self quarantine for 14 days. The positive test came despite strict precautions, including temperature checks, required face masks, and constant sterilization of equipment during workouts. It also comes as many school districts in and around El Paso are expected to begin workouts next Monday. Our reaction is, I'm sure, what other uh, entities in the El Paso area's reaction would be if, if they if they had uh, the same situation that we did. Uh, we don't want to say that we're a cautionary tale uh, or anything like that, but we, we do want to make sure that uh, adequate measures were taken, and as a result of those adequate measures, we still had a situation where a child tested positive. The diocese told KTSM that athletes were not required to get COVID tests prior to the start of workouts. We uh, also spoke with some of the other school districts in town that are going to be starting workouts on Monday. As of right now, that is still the plan. Obviously, though, this is a very fluid situation. Cathedral will shut down for at least 14 days and revisit reopening at a later date. During the suspension, school will clean and sanitize all of its workout areas.